Keep watching, baby. I promise. I promise. I promise. Why, no. Why are you so nervous? Because I don't like you guys. You guys took my dad for eight years. Baby, 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 come here. Baby girl. Baby, 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 come here. Welcome to U.S. Criminals. Watch our latest video on when dumb criminals on three warrants finally gets busted. Featuring dramatic and humorous scenarios of foolish criminals. Join our community by subscribing, liking, and sharing to spread the joy and excitement. Don't forget to turn on notifications so you won't miss out on the next thrilling content. On February 14, 2022, the police received a report about a man operating a vehicle entering Onalaska, Wisconsin. The man behind the wheel was later identified as 22-year-old Noah Betts. Onalaska law enforcement officers managed to spot Noah driving a black Dodge Magnum in the vicinity and were aware of an existing felony warrant against him issued by La Crosse County. Additionally, they were informed that Noah did not hold a valid driver's license and had been driving in a reckless manner across the city of La Crosse. I promise, I promise, I promise. Why, no. why are you so nervous? Because I don't like you guys. You guys took my dad for eight years. Baby, 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 come here. Baby girl. Baby, 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 come here. No, baby, come here. Grandma and the police will be right here, okay? Yep. I hope you die and your family dies. Go on. I'm not going to give you a hug. Okay, I listened to you. Now we're going to walk over there. Let's go. All right. Come on. <laughs> When the officers tried to pull Noah over for a traffic stop, he sped away at a high velocity. We're going to have a traffic stop. We're going to be in the uh, parking lot of Dairy Queen and Georgetown. He's likely going to head south on 1080 at 2nd Street. He was driving at speeds of 80 to 90 miles per hour, behaving recklessly by weaving in and out of traffic and nearly hitting other vehicles. Noah's erratic driving led the officers to end the pursuit and pass on the information to the La Crosse police. Six, can you run a Noah Betts? Uh, he's not stopping. At 10-4. He's probably going to go 1080. We're southbound on second uh, south. Later, a La Crosse police officer found Noah in an anticipated area, but he got out of the vehicle and fled. The officers approached the vehicle, spoke to Noah's father, the registered owner of the vehicle, and the passenger who was accompanying Noah during the chase. Yeah, 312, I discontinued. He was weaving in and out of traffic. He was causing the... Uh, quite the scene. He's southbound on Rose Street. Two occupants. He was the driver. I've discontinued just north of the I. The passenger was unable to provide an answer when questioned by the officers about why they had departed. Don't have any weed on you? No. Nothing whatsoever? No. Nothing in your pockets? Mm -hmm. I have a question. Go ahead. Are you about to open my car door? Yeah. Do you have a warrant? Or? It was uh, using the commission of a felony. Okay, I give up. So, yeah. that's all. All right. Like I said, I'm not going to tear it apart. Certainly not. I can just smell the weed in here. You know, they didn't stop for me. Okay. Your son left. I got it. And that's why. All right. So. When I do locate him, he'll have charges of the uh, felony fleeing and whatever warrants he has still with him. So. Weeks later, officers tried to find Noah at multiple residences. At one particular residence, they noticed illuminated lights and open blinds, prompting them to move closer. As they neared the house, the officers established a perimeter and spotted several individuals inside through the windows. One of the officers peered through the front door and identified Noah. When the officer called out Noah's name, Noah turned to look, and that's when his mother appeared at the door. So I don't know what uh, Noah's up to. Here's my card. Okay. Um, he just keeps digging himself a bigger hole. I, I mean, he's got to realize man. that. I know. Uh, I know. I mean, would the jail even take him? He would have got some paperwork and probably cut loose. 
Really? You think so? Yeah. yeah well, well, you can tell them the you got to be able to pre-approve list or certain charges. Otherwise, yeah. you get a SIG bond and you, you got to show yeah. up in court. COVID shut everything down. They, they can't handle it. They don't want people. They don't fucking want people unless you're killing people and, and whatever. They paper. And do mean, good on paper. Do good on the bracelet. Fucking don't fuck up, man. And and he does stupid shit like this, yeah. and he just keeps piling up. Yeah, I get it. So I appreciate it. I mean, it, it's not going away. So if no, you see him. Go away. He knows that. You might as well tell him to to get a hold of us and yeah, turn it in, and then that way he can take care of it on his terms instead yeah. of yeah, fucking this shit. I get it. I it. Yeah, I know. Yep. I know. So. All right. Well, I don't need guys. the car. You can have the. I appreciate it. You can move it and do yeah, whatever you gotta do with it. And all right. All right. Thanks, Noah got busted on three warrants with some heavy charges, including felonies for running from the cops, jumping bail, and a misdemeanor for driving without a valid license. We talked to Noah. And obviously, he just walked that way. So, easy way and hard way for him right now. We saw him in the room. He's already gone. Well, we have a guy in back, so... That's the only other way to get out. So, he's still in the house. Okay. So... Mom just tried to tell me that he was already out of the house. 4891, you can see the whole back, correct? And you got the salt sign, right? Yeah, I got it. 10-4. Bo's got the salt sign. Until we can absolutely confirm he's still inside the house, just if you want to just check south, just make sure he's not hiding or actually made it out somehow. Time for He's got his shoes on and they're like multicolored pants, like a white bleach stained uh, sweatpant type thing he's got on. He's definitely trying to figure out a way to run. Yeah, just keep an eye on this side. I mean, they got him got it covered on the others, but... Yeah, well, we'll see if we get to go inside or not, so Mom hasn't come back out after she tried to tell me that he already left But then I seen him again, so Yeah, it's fine man if you want to talk to me I it's hard to hear but yeah if you want to come talk Yeah, I'm not gonna rush in I just I'll talk to you right now but I'm not going to rush in, man. Just open the door. I'm not going to rush in. He's just talk talking to his kids. son. Okay, that's fine. And I'll let you talk, it's, man. It's, he wants... It's God's way saying I... Well, we got to get this taken care of. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff going on. I'll talk to my kids before anything. That's fine. If you want to if you want to have a seat in the thing, I'm not going to rush you, arrest you, fight you or nothing right now. I don't want to do that. Don't yeah, don't do that. Can, we, okay. can we arrest him all back? Um, is there, I guess, a reason? I just don't want it right here. Yeah, yeah. that's fine. Thank you. That's fine. If Yeah, there's a patio... Uh, deck and stuff out back. Okay. Well, like I said, I, as long as we communicate, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm okay Plus, taking my time. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm just talking to my kids. Yep. That's it. Like I said, as long as you can communicate, I told that's him. all we it's need time. to do. It's time. It's great. Yep. Let's get this shit done. We're taking care of it. It's worth it, you know? 48, I had contact, verbal contact with Noah. He's cooperating at this point. Okay. I mean, uh, uh, he's going to be out back. Okay. 4891, it sounds like he's gonna come out back. He's just trying to talk to his kids. So, I think he has, I'm pretty sure he has no contact with who he's trying to contact. So, he seems sober, cool, and collective. So, I think he, the only time he's been making bad decisions is when he's not sober. So, good, how you doing? Hi. Yeah. Thanks for being so cool. You just got a couple things to take care of. Yep. You got this. You got this. I love you too. I'm gonna be home, I promise. Yup, just get this shit, get this shit, to, get this shit taken care of and then... How did you not hit my truck? <laughs> I was wondering that. It's like you backed up a couple times. <laughs> we'll put in the report how cooperative he's being too. Yeah. It goes a long way with everything. So. That's what I said. Just, just go with it. Just yeah. Be calm. Do what you gotta do. It's, it's fine. I love you. You got this. I'm sorry, Mom. It's okay. Let's just make it better next time. Okay? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
sick of being a family disappointment. I'm sorry. You're change, man. You're going to be the good dad. This is going to exactly. be correct. Yes, you guys are right. Because we don't want to do this again, right? No. Just remember this right now. For real. You ain't looking over. Just phone numbers. Perfect. I saw you writing them down. I figured it was good they were. All right. I love you. It's okay. I love you. It's all right. You got this. It's gonna go I don't want to do quarantine. <laughs> <laughs> That's why <how> you're. <laughs> I hate it. You don't get to shower. Supposed to be alright. I hate it. I want to let her go. That'll be yeah. the, If that's the worst part of it, you'll be alright. <laughs> you got this. You got this, okay? It was okay. No, not too tight or anything. No, they're fine. Okay. I love you. Just keep your head up, alright? This is it. Just Last time we're doing this, okay? Good man. Yeah. Last Last time we're doing this. All three of you guys, both one more. Okay. <laughs> Don't slip on the ice right here. <laughs> oh my god, we love, love, you. love you. Love you too. Okay, love you. I'm gonna need a fat one when I get out. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say that for us. I love you. I love you guys. Bye. I'm gonna call you. I'm gonna call you. I gave you that hundred six dollars. Real talk though, nice kicks, man. Yeah, for the cheesies. They're all right. They're all right. <laughs> I've had them for like three and a half. Aren't those years. like a three hundred dollar price tag on those? Yeah, I paid three twenty five for them. Yeah. But I got them. These are your phone it's numbers. Yeah, right? it's my phone numbers. <laughs> it's time, man. Well, like I said, let's get all this taken care of so you don't have to look behind you anymore. I did dust your friend though. Huh? I did dust your. That wasn't ours. That was OPD. Alaska? Yeah. Why, why, would we, why would we put anybody else in danger, man? You <laughs> gave up as soon as I touched that bush. Well, yeah, we don't want to put anybody else in danger. I love you, Mom! Love you, Mom! I love you guys! Love you. Forever! Love you. This is time to be changed. That's right! Keep that energy! Yup, period. Period! <laughs> I love you! Love you! Thanks, all. Yep. Awesome one. I ain't never had this many cops want to come and see me though. Well, we just don't. We want to make it so no one has to fight, man. Yeah. Our, that hurts so much. If you have this much presence, sometimes you make better choices. How'd you guys know I was there? How? Yeah. We, we've been, dude. I've been checking all your places. And then we came by. We seen the lights on. So I said, well, at least we'll go take a peek in the window and see what, uh, see what's there. And we just the way we the way I say that obviously as soon as I got to the window I seen you and then when you got up I'm like well there he is and I mean I've been lo I was looking for you yesterday and the day before too I just get lucky every now and then this thing needs brakes yes it does it's it's in it's in the order man yeah I see <laughs> <laughs> the back one's rubbing a little bit thank you for letting me talk to my kids too like I said man as long as you're cool calm and collected I'll take all the time I need yep. I appreciate that we get paid the same you know. Cause yeah, honestly, as soon as I seen you, we could have came right in, but no sense in that. Take time, to wait for you to make a good decision. That way you can get better. Yeah, they all convinced me that this was the time. Yeah, you just gotta get, just take care of your stuff, man. So you don't have to look over your shoulder every day you drive or every day you're doing something, man. Yeah, I was getting sick of it anyways. Mm -hmm. It's not fun. It's not a way of life. It's stressful. Mm -hmm. Feel trapped. Every yeah. every time you see a certain car, you think, "Oh God, there's cops," and then you have to change your entire routine for the day. And the more you run and hide, the more we get to know you. <laughs> the more digging we do. Well, I know you didn't want to run in those Yeezys. Shit, that would make me run faster. <laughs> <laughs> those are expensive. I didn't think you want to ruin them. Get all scuffed up. We we weren't playing the run game today. I. I already had four guys, and we were watching watching the house before we even approached. Do you know you had a Juno County warrant too? Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah, get this stuff cleared up, man. Yeah, I want to go back to normal. Is it a lot of does like a lot of some of the decisions you make get worse when you're drinking or what? Like, cause I. I mean, obviously, I've I've seen you on body cam. I've seen you on YouTube. I mean, it looks like most of the kind of when you're at your worst, it seems to be under the influence. Yeah. I haven't been. I haven't. I don't. It's been a while since I've drank. Yeah. Got to find an alternative to that. What are your thoughts when you look back at those videos? Embarrassing. Hold on to that thought, man. Try not to ever put yourself in that in those shoes again. You know? Yeah.
Yeah, you got a kid, right? Yeah, I got two. Yeah. And you gotta be the role model, right? All that kind of cliche stuff. You gotta make good choices, be the role model, stuff like that. What were you guys playing on Xbox? I was playing GTA. <laughs> of course you would be. Uh. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, so once you get out, man, just make sure you go to your court appearances and take care of that stuff so you don't get warrants and you don't have to be worrying about everything and get, get everything cleared up. Yeah, my head is all moggled right now. Probably not going to eat for a couple days. Well, hopefully maybe you'll kind of be able to reset a little bit. I just hate quarantine. Yeah, that's not a fun thing. I said the last time I sat, I graduated high school. Yeah, dude, you got... It's time, man. I've known your name and known of you. I mean, I knew you were when you, when you were in school yet and still juvenile. So I've been here 10 years, and I think it's time for you, man, to not be going back to this jail. It's time to grow the fuck up. That's what my uh, dad said. Well, yeah, I mean, it's just, you gotta start making good choices. That's all, I mean, it comes down to what you want, man. You can make your life hard and crappy, or you can make some good choices and provide and be there for your kids, man. So when I get out, I'm gonna hopefully move to just yeah. start, start a DNA new, alpha alpha now. Start a new life. Yeah, you just gotta get your stuff taken care of and focus on you too right away, just so you can get your, your stuff taken care of first. That's sometimes people forget to do that. Take care of themselves before they start trying to take care of everybody else. Trying to hurry. I feel like I'm gonna puke. What was that? Yeah, we're here. My anxiety is like running to the roof. I feel like I'm gonna puke. Yeah, we're here, man. I can't, I can't <laughs> speed to get you here. Huh? I can't speed to get you here. <laughs> oh, fuck. You got your window down or what? I see the garbage right away. No, oh, dude, do not do it in my car for the love of God. I'm trying not to. I'm trying. My stomach hurts. Deep now. breaths. in my car. I, I, will, I will make you clean that up. <laughs> Is that just from your anxiety or what? Yeah. Take deep, I just ate. Take deep breaths, man. It's not the end. It's not the end. Oof, I'm downwind. <laughs> now the jail's gonna think you're sick. I'm not, I swear. All right. I'll let you take care of the garbage. Oh. <laughs> I'll bring a garbage can over by you. Let's have a seat right there, man. So you keep Ooh. trying to take deep breaths. Oh. Have a seat over here. Just trying to no, I get face you. myself. <laughs> More reason not to ever come back, man. Well, right. except man, just get the stuff all taken care of, and then don't don't be doing that I'm stupid of stuff, I man. To, I need to leave this town. No. It's the people that are in this town that I hang around. I just can't break the cycle yeah. of hanging with them. It's hard. Well, it's just sometimes just too trying to either impress them or be cool around yeah. them. I mean, but you don't have to do it. I mean, you don't have to do stuff that's gonna get you in jail to be, you know, so I'm liked. Gonna go, I'm gonna, go to I'm gonna yeah. become a homebody. When asked about it. He admitted feeling embarrassed, saying, I'm embarrassed. However, someone advised him not to overthink it and just warned him, don't do it again, don't worry about that. Join us on the U.S. Criminals YouTube channel for the video when dumb criminals on three warrants finally gets busted, an unmissable hilarious situation. Subscribe, like, and share to spread the joy. And don't forget to turn on notifications to catch the next exciting content.